Now one of the largest cemeteries in the United States, Arlington National Cemetery has an interesting history. Before the United States government decided to use the land for a cemetery, it was a small log cabin owned by George Washington Park Custis, George Washington's adopted grandson. Later, when Custis died, the land was passed on to his sister, Mary Custis, and her husband, First Lieutenant Robert E. Lee. When the Civil War started, Robert E. Lee decided to abandon the property and move south. As soon as he did, the United States government seized the opportunity to take the land and used it as a hospital for wounded soldiers. Today, the Arlington National Cemetery is the final resting place of over 400,000 men and women who lost their lives fighting for our country. All who are remembered here have one thing in common, service to their country. Welcome to Arlington National Cemetery. As we enter, you will see the theme of white marble and granite used throughout. As we enter the main building, you will find an information desk, a gift shop, a map of the cemetery, and specialized computers that are able to find the location of any specific gravesite. Now we enter the outdoor cemetery grounds. Over 400,000 servicemen and their family are laid to rest here. About 20 burials are conducted every weekday. The granite and marble markers and memorials reflect our American history. Those eligible to be buried at Arlington include active duty military and veterans of our country's conflicts and wars. One of the most famous and most visited graves is the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, also known as the Tomb of the Unknowns. Here, a sentinel of the 3rd U.S. Infantry maintains the vigil 24-7. The sentinel paces 21 steps down the mat before the tomb, pauses 21 seconds, and returns. The changing of the guard takes place every hour. The tomb represents the unknown servicemen who gave their lives in World War I, World War II, the Korean War, and the Vietnam War. Some fun facts about Arlington National Cemetery are, there are over 3,000 different species of trees on the 624 acres of land. U.S. presidents are allowed to be buried at Arlington whether they served or in the military or not, and that the cemetery conducts about 7,000 burials each year. Next, here are some of the most well-known grave sites. These seven graves represent the seven astronauts who lost their lives in the Challenger explosion in January of 1986. This tomb is William Howard Taft, the 27th President of the United States. Ted and Robert Kennedy, JFK's brothers, are also buried here. The famous actor, Audie Murphy, is bar buried in Arlington. The previous landowner, George Washington Park Custis, is also buried here. But probably the most famous is the final resting place of President John F. Kennedy, who lies beneath the eternal flame in Lot 45, Section 30. There are also 28 special memorial monuments honoring various wars and conflicts.